What's up, Scorpio? And welcome to my channel. I hope all of you guys out there are doing well. So, Scorpio, this is going to be a twin flame reading, okay? This is going to be for my divine masculine, divine feminines. Hey, take the energy how it resonates, you guys, okay? I've already shuffled, meditated over your cards. So, let's get into this reading. So, this is going to be messages from the karmic, okay? I pull from the divine masculine. We're going to see what's going on with his energy, and then we're going to pull some messages from the karmic. Okay, so you're a divine masculine, divine feminine, take it how you want to, but your twin is saying that you were right about the karmic, Scorpio. So it could have been something that you told your twin or your divine masculine about their karmic or one of the karmas that they were dealing with, and I feel like whatever you said, it, it, it really happened, okay? And this person, I feel like your twin sitting here like, well, damn, how, how did Scorpio know that? Like, this person, can they see into the future? So, I feel like, like I said, listen to tarot, or maybe you use your intuition, but it was something that you told this person about this karmic, and you was exactly right, okay? And whatever it is, like I said, it could have been something you told them, but I feel like over time, your twin is realizing that they made the wrong choice, okay? And they really don't want to be with this karmic anymore. I feel like their energy is being pulled more towards you guys, and I feel like this karmic also realizes that this that your twin, your divine masculine, doesn't want to be with this karmic anymore either, okay? They could be arguing more, or they can just feel your twin pulling their energy back, okay? And your divine masculine wants to say that they hope that you are not looking for their replacement, okay? Why? Because this person is trying to work on themselves. So, Scorpio, your twin hopes that you are not looking for their replacement because this person is saying they're trying to work on themselves. I feel like your divine masculine is saying they need just a little bit more time to work on themselves, Scorpio. So let's see. What's going Matter of fact, let's pull a couple more cards from this masculine. And then we'll pull some messages from this karmic. What messages do you have for my Scorpios today, sweetie? Let's pull one more card from this masculine, and then we'll see what this karmic is talking about. What messages do you have for my masculine today, spirit? Go ahead, we got cards all over the place. I'm going to take this one. Okay, so for some of you, the reason why this person went toward this karmic, okay, was because this, your twin felt like you had too many expectations, Scorpio, okay? So some of these karmics, or maybe with this one particular karmic that your divine masculine was dealing with, it was like they went with people that didn't have expectations, okay? So that meant they went toward people that's going to let them do what they want to, okay? So they're not going to question them, they're not going to bother them they're not gonna do nothing okay because scorpio we got standards and stuff okay so you weren't gonna continue to let your twin like come in and out of your life you won't let this person call you and text you when they wanted to like your person felt the need to be in control and they want to be around people that was gonna let them be in control they want to be around people that was gonna let them do what they want to do with no questions asked and that's exactly what this karma did okay this karma gave your person exactly what they wanted just to keep them around so let's see what's going on with this karma what messages do you have for my Scorpios today, Spirit? All right. So, we have, I would never let them go. So, this karmic is saying they don't give a damn about what happened, Scorpio. They are never going to let your divine masculine or your divine feminine go. They're going to continue to hold on to this person. This karma is going to continue to work whatever tricks, whatever magic that him or, or her has to do to keep your person stuck. They put, they are so weak and easy for me to take advantage of. So this is why this karmic is saying they're not going to never let them go. Because I feel like this karmic is saying like they know your twins' weaknesses, okay? And it's like they can do whatever they want because this person knows what makes them weak, okay? Because they know that you have so many expectations, okay? And your person does not want to put in the work, you know, to deal with you. So this person saying they're so weak and easy for me to take advantage of. Ain't that something? All right, Scorpio, what message do you have from this karma spirit? What does this karma have to say today, spirit, for my Scorpio? Okay, so for some of you, we are binding together financially, okay? So for some of you guys, your twin could have been married to this karma that they were dealing with, and they're saying they could, they could have, like, financial documents, so they have some type of financial agreements that are bind together, so they can have, like, checking accounts, savings accounts, cars, how notes, mortgages, all that stuff, like they are bound together financially. And I feel like your twin, let me tell you something what this karma possibly does. Because your twin, know, and I feel like that's one reason why your twin possibly was stuck in this connection. Because they don't want to spend that money. They know that they got these financial situations with this karma. And they don't want to spend that extra money to get out of those situations, okay? 
What message do you have for my Scorpio? What y'all had was just a fling. So I feel like for some of you guys, your masculine or feminine could have told this karma. Like, you know, what me and Scorpio had was just a fling. It wasn't nothing serious like that. But I feel like this person, one, they was lying to their damn self, Scorpio. And then two, they was lying to this karma. They didn't want this karma to really know how they felt about you, Scorpio. So this Carmen like trying to tell you all Scorpio, all y'all had was a fling, what y'all had, it wasn't real love. You know, what we got is real love. That's basically what this Carmen trying to say. But guess what, Scorpio? They argue with this karmic every day. That's why they're saying they really don't want to be with this karmic anymore because all they do is argue every dog on day. They can't get along. They argue they probably accusing each other of doing different stuff like this is not a happy place. This is not what this person really wants to be doing. We get one more card from my Scorpio spirit. And then we have, yeah, I know about this connection. And I would do everything in my power to stop it, okay? So this person, I said, they know. For some of you, the karma does know about you. And it's whether your divine masculine or feminine told them about you. They could have caught your person, you know, reading old text messages. They could have caught them on the phone with you, like anything. But this person knows, this karma knows about this connection. But yet still, this person saying that they will never let them go. And they're going to do everything in their power to stop this connection, Scorpio. All right, you guys, that's all I have. I hope something here has resonated. If it did, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe, Scorpio.